in the National League, the Mets started out a house of fire and have obviously uh, cooled off a bit uh, of late with uh, Matt Harvey now being um, – discussed in New York in terms that uh, are are flat out unflattering for him. Uh, the headline in the New York Post that was today in particular was quite something. We're going to put it up on the screen here uh, for our television viewers to see where it, it, it just wonders if he's done in New York, whether he's going to be certainly done as a starter, whether he's done uh, and he's going to be put down in the minor leagues. What's going on with him, Peter? Well, it was really interesting last night because um, uh, Mickey Callaway was asked after the game, oh, you know, is he going to make his next start? And Mickey said, well, we haven't determined that yet. And with a hint that, you know, maybe he would go to the bullpen. And then Harvey, of course, was asked, and he said, no, I'm a starter. Um, there's a realization that has to come in. One, the velocity now is 91 to 93. It's not 96 to 98 as it was, his breaking ball is not as good right now. It, now all of that could come back. But one of the things I, I find so interesting about baseball and the way um, teams approach uh, their pitchers with the analytics and the pitch back stuff and all the things, that pitchers have to make adjustments uh, constantly in, in how they attack hitters. And that's something Matt's going to have to do. He's going to have to realize – uh, that he's not the same guy. He can make a mix, get his curveball back, um, and make some adjustments. I mean, I, it's hard to say he can be traded. He's a free agent at the end of the season. And I don't know if someone's going to pay 7 or $8 million for, for Matt Harvey right mm. now or well, give, he, give the Mets anything. The amazing thing is he, so, he, he looked to have been one day maybe a, you know, a Kershaw-type pitcher. Where that, that, that's where it's been. And now, now the headline of today's post in the back page, it says the Joker. Not you know, because he's the Dark Knight. Yeah, it, it, it's a it, daily it's news. Hard. Pardon me. I, mean, I think it's hard for um, for Matt to 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 accept what's happened. I think that's going to be a big part of it. Changing his repertoire, changing how he approaches hitters, um, and something that has to be done. If it has to be done through the bullet, whatever. Mickey Callaway has been very successful, obviously, as a as a pitching guru in Cleveland, and. Matt's going to have to make some changes and see what happens. I don't think he's done. I think he's capable. I mean, I thought when he threw really hard that he could really pitch, too. And But Matt loves that New York life. He kind of, you know, he, he approaches life as if he's walking down the runway. And he's not going to be on the runway anymore. I mean, it, going into the beginning of the season, we knew the Mets had two great starting pitchers. We didn't know what was going to happen with Mass. We didn't know what was going to happen with Wheeler. We didn't know what was happen, going to happen with Harvey. Mass has been okay, pretty good. Um, Wheeler threw very well in his last start. Now, you know, Matt is going to have to make those changes and, and mm. make some adjustments. Um, and I do believe that the realization that, uh, that his career is um, – at crossroads here, and that um, not only this year with the Mets, but if he wants to go out in the market and make good money next year, um, he can't just pitch well in the fifth and sixth innings a couple of times. He's going to have to go out and win games, and, and uh, uh, it'll be interesting to see how he reacts. I think it's hard for him, but at the same time, I, I still think it, it can happen because he's made adjustments before. I mean, I, I remember... Um, in college, he really only had one half a good year in college. And when he played in the Cape Cod League, he got tattooed. Mm. So, I mean, he, he built off of that. He can build off what's going on here now. But it's it, it's going to be very interesting to see how he accepts criticism. And if he thinks that people are out to get him, he's not going to – it's going to be a long process. And if it's a long process – it's going to be out of the bullpen. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.